Hey there, Tigers. The last thing that we're going to look at is your Tiger Connect and your single sign-on information. Your single sign-on information is where you'll have access to your Office 365, Blackboard, and Tiger Connect. So after going to cali.edu and hitting the login button, you will be directed to this screen. From here, you can choose which one you would like to do. First, we're going to look at your Office, your Cali email, Office 365. As a Cali student, you now have access to Office 365. This means that you have Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and Access, so don't feel the need to go out and buy this information. To access these things, you can click right here on this little grouping, and you can select the item that you're looking for. What's really neat about this stuff now is that you can download each individual app on your computer, and you don't have to download the entire Office suite, so only use what you need. This is also where your mail is. Student email is very important that you check at least once a day. This is where your teachers will communicate with you along with the college. This is important because important information like textbook rental due dates, college closings, and important COVID information is sent. So check that whenever you can. The next thing that will pop up on here is your Blackboard. Blackboard is where all your online classes is, as you can tell. Now for this, you will click on each individual class and it will take you to much like the setup of this course. Your classes will not show up until the first day of class, so don't panic if your classes aren't there the Friday before. The last thing that we're going to look at is Tiger Connect, and Tiger Connect is where all your personal information is stored. So when you log into Tiger Connect, if you click on the student, it's going to have different areas that you can click on. We've already looked at finance and payments, so we're going to look at registration next. After this semester, you will be able to enroll yourself in any class that you would like to. You can search by different areas, like fall, the entire fall schedule. You can look at even by eight weeks. When you do this, it's going to bring up everything under that term that you wanted. The add buttons right here will allow you to add the course. Now, once you do this, the advisor will have to approve it, and that might take a day or two. So this will reserve your spot, though. If you have questions about this and ready to enroll when spring opens in October, feel free to contact your um, advisor. The other thing that we're going to look at is advising and degree information. This is where you're going to find that wonderful degree plan that we talked about earlier in this, set, in this course. So what you're going to do here is that if you would like to see your details, you'll click view all details. And like I said, it might take a minute for this to load. Do not double click as it will start you over. And you can look at your academic worksheet and your academic plan. And this is where you're going to see that. If you feel that something is complete and it's not marked, please contact your advisor. Other things on Tiger Connect include forms. This is where you can find your change of information form, which allows you to change your address, email, advisor, and everything like that. It also is where you can find the student appeal form, and this is for when you would like to appeal a grade that you feel should have been different. So please be sure that you look at all these and everything like that. If you have questions about any of these forms, please do not hesitate to contact us. The other nice thing on here is my textbooks. Now, I did have to drop Tank from his classes, but you should be able to go by year and term and hit submit, and it's going to bring up everything that you need for those classes. Keep in mind that when ordering from the bookstore, you can have it shipped to your home, or if you live near or around Arc City, you can pick them up there. Other items on the Tiger Connect include your transcript information. So when you click on registration, you can actually go see your grade report. Now your grade report can be your current grade report, which is live time, or your final grade report. So if you do need this information, you can actually find this on Tiger Connect. The other thing you can do is your unofficial transcript. You have access to this the entire time while you're a student and even after you're a student. So if you need to supply this to your insurance company or anything like that, this will work. If you have to order an official transcript, you will have to go through our main page under college transcripts to request those, which are $6.50. This is, in general, what the whole single sign-on covers. Now, when you first log in, you should have been prompted to password reset. Please ensure that you do this, so that way if you have to go on campus for any reason, you do not lock yourself out of the account. We cannot see any passwords that you change from the traditional last four, the first four of your last name, capital letter, and the last four of your social. So please answer those questions, that way you can unlock yourself. If you have any questions about Blackboard, Office 365, or Tiger Connect, please do not hesitate to contact us as we are here to help.